All right, Coach, Saturday, you know, you guys got banged up a little bit, but you have to also feel good about how with a lot of the second string guys and some backup guys that you, you really hung with, with Houston and, and, you know, towards the end of the game, it kind of got out of hand, but it was it was a close game. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, with about seven minutes and 45 seconds to go and down by five, we kind of lost the game, and uh, that was the disappointing part. But I thought, you know, being down 21 nothing and fighting back to actually have a chance to win the football game uh, gave me a good feeling of, of our, our attitude and our pride and our work ethic, and, you know, we, we're not giving up, not quitting. And then, as you mentioned, you know, we've got several players that were injured. Uh, you know, Ryan Griffin uh, basically uh, sprained his left shoulder, and uh, so, so Kevin Moore had to go in and, and did a, a real good job in the fourth quarter. He broke two bones in his throwing hand, his index finger, and that's why he threw the ball poorly at the end. Uh, but uh, hopefully within a couple of weeks, maybe he can return. And then Orleans Darkwa, he, he has a tendon that was torn uh, in his, his elbow, and he's out uh, for several weeks. Hopefully he won't need surgery. We had some ankle sprains and some little things, but none of those will keep these guys out of games. So now you get to turn the page and, and you start a fresh week. You look forward to Rutgers on uh, Saturday. Well, yeah, it's always uh, good to put the last one behind you and look forward to the, the next one, uh, win or lose. But, uh, you know, again, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're on the cusp of doing some good things. And I, I think, uh, you know, we, we, we have proven that uh, we've improved. Uh, now we've got to take the next step and we've got to win those close games.